yes, it is. <laughs> it, is I, it is intolerant to think that Jesus is the only way to God. Um, but I don't know if because it's intolerant, you could say, therefore, it's not true. I mean, there's a lot of things that seem either unfair or intolerant that we know are com completely true, and that's just the way it is. Does that make it, I guess, right or moral or good? Or, you know, is God just harsh and hateful? I actually agree with most people that say there's lots of different pathways to God. I think that at the end of all those pathways, though, we're going to run into Jesus. Um, and so I think somebody that grows up in a, Bo a Buddhist family or an atheist family, uh, they're taking different pathways. But I think scriptures say anybody that's really truly trying to seek truth in God will find Jesus in the end. So I know uh, Muslim friends of mine that have actually found and come to faith in Jesus by growing up and reading the Quran that led them to Jesus. And I've had some Buddhist friends, the same deal, that they're... Buddhist faith eventually drew them to ask this question of sin and then that drew them to Jesus. So I don't mind 50 different pathways, I'm cool with that, but I think at the end of the road we run into the eyeballs of, uh, of Jesus. Christianity is the fairest system imaginable. Everybody gets in the same way. Everybody gets in the same way. So whether you're Jewish or Muslim or Hindu or atheist or you know, you've grown up in a Christian home, whatever your background, everybody gets in the same way and everybody can meet the requirement. The requirement is simply faith, you know, and not a special kind of faith, not like, man, you know, that guy had good faith and I had bad faith. Like when I, be, when I became a Christian, I had crappy faith, like I had the worst faith. Sometimes people think that uh, to say that Jesus is the way, you know, to God, um, that that's intolerant in some way of other beliefs and other systems. And I want to take that kind of a uh, statement and claim very seriously uh, because I do think we have a lot of behavior and statements that uh, don't lend themselves very well to us kind of living together in some way. But again, as I approach these issues and think about them philosophically and theologically, it's not intolerant to say that Jesus is the only way. I think if we take the claims of Jesus himself seriously, and if he makes this statement, then what we are trying to do is give testimony and affirm the fact of the truthfulness of his statements and his self-understanding. If he is not who he claimed to be, right, then it's not so much that the claim is intolerant as it is false. But if he is who he claimed to be, then the issue is one of truth. And so while we can hold beliefs in an intolerant way, the very claim itself is not intolerant.